Hi there, this is Fixed It. I put Duracell batteries in this RSV2, so I'll switch them on. Now you'll know from the previous video that with rechargeable batteries inside him, he wasn't able to lie down and then stand back up again. So let me just consult the manual. So shift to... He performed that a lot better than last time. He wasn't toppling. And now what I want to do is to do shift three, the square. That's interesting, is it the carpet? Let me go and try that downstairs. So that's interesting. Hey, where did it go? He made a much better try at getting up, but basically the weight in his feet isn't enough to be able to pull him up. Now whether or not that's due to the age of him, perhaps the springs aren't as strong as they were originally. I should imagine they've weakened over time because it is a lot of the spring as well as everything else that lifts him up. But he didn't complain that there was a bad motivator, which he would do if he got stuck. He literally hasn't got the weight or the strength in his springs to be able to get him back up again. So that was an interesting test. So better with extra weight in his feet. So let's just see how he walks. Backwards and forwards. So let's go backwards. Nice slipping on the floor. <laughs> okay, and backwards again. Double lock. Stop it. And forwards. And forwards again. Interesting. It's interesting that one, hey, of, one of his gates, little shuffling steps, even though it's quick, and the other one is much better for walking, both forwards and backwards. Okay, so obviously the age of the robot does affect some of its abilities due to the fact that it is manufactured with a lot of springs as well as servos but it does show that it does go better on 1.5 volt batteries rather than rechargeables. I hope you liked the video, thanks for watching, bye.